Hey everybody, so welcome back to your girl's channel. It's your girl Angelina, of course. Oh my gosh, guys, sorry I'm looking a little crazy. It's really late. I just came back from tanning. I am a little burnt. But, girl, I miss you guys. It's been over a week since the last time I recorded a video for you guys. I apologize. Life kind of got in the way. So, yeah, I really missed you guys so very much. I really, really wanted to make more videos for you guys. But, of course, like I said, everything uh, happens. And, yeah, I got a little bit busy during the week, so I couldn't record for you guys. But your girl is back, and she's back with a really good haul today. So, yeah, I hope everybody's having a wonderful and blessed day. And I hope you guys miss me like I missed you guys. So, yeah, I'm just going to jump right in. And I have um, stuff from Marshalls, Burlington, and Ross. And like every video, we're going to save the best for last. And that will be our banger. So make sure you stick around to the very end of the video for the banger. And this is from Burlington. So, yeah, I guess I'm going to start off with Marshalls. I only got one item from Marshalls and I thought it was absolutely so pretty and this is like for winter time um, it's kind of like a really light gray and it's like this really quilted don't mind my finger I cut my finger earlier it's like a quilted um, top and I just love the neckline and the waist it looks like it's gonna be really slimming and really flattering on it just kind of like cinches you in at the waist and then the rest is kind of like loose and then the wrists are fitted as well and this was girl I paid $16.99 I guess I paid $16.99 for this and the brand is called pink rose and it's called white heather gray that's the color I thought this was absolutely beautiful so super cute and I cannot wait for winter time and I think it's just gonna look really really pretty on um, but yeah I just love the material of this so stinking pretty and the sleeves are like more fitted as well just like the waist which is really really nice and sorry don't mind don't mind how I'm looking right now, girl. Don't mind. So, when I seen this shirt, I was like, oh my god, how stinking cute is that? And the color and the knit of it and the cut and all that is really, really pretty. And then when I came home, I'm like, sorry if I'm washing in and out red. I am just got back from tanning, so I am a little bit red right now. Um, I have this really pretty guest purse and this was from Burlington and see the color guys I thought that this was gonna be so pretty together like yes and some black jeans and heels or something or even leggings sorry I'm like I can't even show properly um I just thought that that would look so stinking pretty because the colors are very similar so yeah this was from Burlington and I think it was like $34.99 something like that so yeah I cannot wait to wear those together absolutely gorgeous and so I'm just gonna show you this um, this was from Burlington as well but we're gonna save the best for last um, even though they're both from the same store, but this one um, is from Burlington and you got cute little Hello Kitty and her little flowers Okay, so yeah, I got this Hello Kitty shirt from Burlington and I believe She was $6.99 And I just like the neon and the pink and the red and it's just so cute it says the grass is greener where you water it so I just thought that was so cute she is a long baggy crop top in a size extra large I believe she's extra large yeah extra large so cute 
So yeah, and yeah, I can't wait to wear it. Absolutely cute. And I just love how big and wide these crop tops are. So stinking cute. And this is the best priced um, t-shirt that I have found so far, $6.99 for this is really, really awesome. Okay, moving on to Ross. Um, I had stuck my Ross stuff in my Marshalls bag, so I'm going to go with Marshalls first because I only got two things from there. Alright, so, I just found this peeking out, and anything pink, I gotta take a look at it, because you never know, it could be anything, Barbie, yeah. So, I found this really cute, um, cropped tie-dye Barbie shirt, and this was at Marshall's. And it was $10.99 with the Barbie logo. So cute. So yeah, it's just a baby pink tie-dye with white Barbie writing. So stinking cute. And this is a crop top, but it's more kind of like a fitted crop, if that makes sense. Um, it is um, wide, but it's more like a fitted tee. So... I really like that and I like that the material is super soft because sometimes the shirt could be really cute but it could be made really cheap so or like the t-shirts that they print on are not always the best quality but this is super soft and I really appreciate that a lot alright so the next and last thing I got from Marshall's was a workout outfit now this caught my eye the last time I was there, but I wasn't too sure on the color because they also had another print that was black and white. But of course, I went with this color. And I don't know, is it ugly? You guys let me know down below. Um, this was a little pricey, but then again, it is a, um, a top with leggings. So it is a top and bottom set. So it does come with like this cropped uh, sports bra top, I guess. Yeah, this is like athletic um, athletic wear. So this is the back and it's kind of crisscross. And this is the front. And on the front, it does have this like cutout that is like a V open cut out, which is really cute. And this is a large. If they had extra large, I would have got it, but I didn't. I hope it fits. It really stood out to me. Now, I really, and it, it's like a green, gray, and black and beige. So very neutral, in my opinion. And yeah, it just has like the double layer. I'm sorry. The, can't show you properly it does have like a a double layer of like a stretchy sports bra on the inside which is really nice it gives you extra support and yeah so this was a little bit pricier and it's because it's a two-piece set so this is the top and here is the bottoms and they are just long legging capris I think they would come up a little bit before my ankle and the price I don't see the price tag on here but I know they were $29.99 so around $30 for this set I thought it was so cute um yeah and if I decide to keep it because I don't know I didn't try it on I'm usually like a large or extra large and yeah so if I like how they fit I will probably wear it in one of my next videos so you guys can see how it looks so yeah super cute I love the material super silky a little bit pricey but like I said if it really catches my catches my eye of course I want to get it but yeah I'm just gonna see how well that looks 
out super super cute always check out their athletic stuff because yes we love girly stuff but your girl wants to look cute and sexy too so that's it for marshall's um i am on the hunt now girls 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 come on in and let me know i have been on the hunt for the new juicy couture purses they are all velour suede and they're beautiful they come in uh hot pink they come in black with a little heart uh hot pink heart and then they come with a gr uh, i think it's green and black and then baby pink and brown i am on the hunt for every single one of those like i am so in love with the style they are so beautiful and gorgeous the ones that i'm really 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 wanting is the hot pink one the black with the hot pink heart and the green one but in order is hot pink and then black but yes girl if you guys found them at your guys's stores let me know down below and did you pick any of them up they are $29.99 but girl they are absolutely beautiful i think i'm a little late on the juicy couture purse train but you never know i might come across it i might never come across it but that's okay because then it wasn't meant to be so i just have to look at it as that anyways moving on to ross now i just uh put it in the marshall's bag but yeah so I just got two things from Ross. I wanted to get more, but I decided to hold off and put some things back. I might go back later on if they still have this stuff and pick up the other couple items I put back. I was debating on what I should get, but I'm looking at the quality. Um, the print was really cute, but the quality wasn't there, so I had to let her go. Okay, this one really caught my eye because the color girl it just popped and stood out so yes I found this really cute brat t-shirt and I just fell in love with the purple they're all highlighted in purple which is so stunning absolutely beautiful the girls look so stinking cute yes I got it extra large this shirt is like an acid wash um, material like acid wash color and it just says brats and they're all highlighted and they look beautiful this is a regular basic long t-shirt it's not a crop but I had to get it this was $9.99 $9.99 at Ross super cute and girl if you don't feel comfortable wearing these out in public because like they might be um girly like little girlish you can wear them to sleep wear them to bed throw some uh shorts and one of your cute little t-shirts on um or just say screw it who cares because everybody has different styles and different tastes and girl i don't care i will walk out with some hello kitty on or barbie like you don't have to be a little girl to love these things these are super cute and people have different styles so right okay so this is super cute it's not pink but i had to get it because it's so so soft like the material is really really soft on the inside and the outside so this is the last item before our banger so just letting you know and i had to pick up this barbie sweatshirt and i believe this is an extra large and it is acid wash i wish it was pink but that's okay um it does have a pink writing but everything on it is so it's so nice like the material of this sweatshirt is super super good quality the inside is really soft i did try these on in store and yeah i absolutely love it it looks so cute on you can dress it up with some leggings i mean dress it up girl what you gonna do wearing barbie like all dressed up girl do you i mean i was i'm wearing shorts so i had tried this on with shorts it looks cute with shorts leggings jeans whatever you want to wear it's gonna look cute and it was $16.99 also with the barbie logo super cute so yeah make sure you guys check out your sweaters and stuff 
lady is just so buttery soft i am so so happy it was a little bit more pricey like you know 16.99 but you're paying for the quality so i really really like that as well okay so that was everything and yeah it's time for our banger of the day i hope you guys missed me because i missed all of you so yeah comment down below a heart emoji if you stuck around to the very end of the video okay burlington now like i said i was on the hunt for those purses and girl they're supposed to be at tj maxx and marshall's hmm. i've been searching i've been calling i've been going every day and i cannot find them but i went to burlington last night and bam i turned the corner and i i, I like boom boom i got blinded by this bag and i know i feel like this bag has been around last year i never seen it personally i've never um seen it in person i just seen it online but sorry about the color change i found this really pretty juicy couture purse at burlington oh my gosh she is so pretty absolutely love now this is called dusty blush b classic satchel so that's what it's called it's originally 99 dollars and i got it for 27.99 and she is just so pretty oh i just need a wallet to match um i don't know if i'm gonna keep the strap I might cut the strap off and then buy a different, like, a chain or something to clip onto it or leave it. But I don't really care for the strap. It's really thin. Um, but I do like holding with these handles. are really, really nice. And I don't want to show you with that hand because my band-aid. But the zipper is really, really pretty. It says Juicy Couture in the little heart, which is so cute. And I just absolutely love the rhinestones. They're like iridescent rhinestones. And it says Juicy. And this is really like a big purse. And I just thought it was so pretty. Can you see the sparkle? So yeah, $27.99 at Burlington. And oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. I'm gonna cry. I don't know if I'm gonna cut this out of the video or not, but I just found something on the purse. And I am like a perfectionist when it comes to bags and I'm like checking them religiously to see if there's anything wrong with them. And um, girl, you're gonna freak out because I just freaked out. Now I'm hoping, oh my gosh, okay, I can get it off, but I'm gonna show you before I try and take it off. Burlington or makers of the juicy bag why please check your purses before you send them off to be sold are you ready what i just found oh my god <laughs> what is that oh my god look at that oh heck no now i'm looking at it is there any more on the purse I guess they didn't check it. Oh my gosh, have you guys ever bought a purse or bought anything at that and um, there was something wrong with it and you didn't notice that at first? Cause that I literally almost cried, but it came off, whatever it was. 
it came off. I was wondering what that was last night because I felt something sticky when I was holding the straps. Um, but I didn't examine it. I just kind of, I was more, okay, this is what I do. So when I go and I find purses, I make sure that the, the eye view that you're going to see of the purse is in mint condition. And what I mean about that is there was only two of these, this one and one other one. And I look at the straps to make sure they're not bad. Like this one's a little twisted, but you know, it's gonna happen. It's very thin um, strap, but I'm looking at the rhinestones to make sure all the rhinestones are on, that they're still shiny and not foggy because some of them could be foggy just with maybe there was a wrapping and you take it off, some could be missing. If there's any indent scratches or cuts, um, dents in the bag on where your purse is actually being shown when you wear it. So yeah, just keep that in mind when you are looking for purses or anything of that, like shirts, clothes, jackets, pants. Um, I always double check before I buy it just to make sure that there isn't anything wrong with it. There was a certain Juicy Couture purse at Burlington that I grabbed super quick. I was like, I'm surprised nobody got this. It was the only one there. But, and it was uh, the baby pink uh, billboard one with like the tan background or something. Oh my gosh, it was so cute. It was like the bowler bag or something. Somebody, I don't know if maybe it happened when they were opening the box and uh, unloading the purses. Somebody, either with a razor blade or something, it had a slit straight down. You couldn't see it unless you moved the bag a certain way and it opened. So, unfortunate things like that do happen. I always try to check and make sure that there's no cuts because this material is really soft that if you accidentally scrape it with your nail it will skid it or like scrape it so yeah and I do look at hardware as well like this one don't mind my band-aid this one did not have a plastic over it so that I did take into consideration as well like you know people sometimes they take those things off just to get a better look at the purse or shirt or whatever um so yeah and even tags girls if you are buying purses and you aren't gonna wear them cut the tags off don't leave the tags on your purses if you're storing them away stuff like this can scratch your purse these are very sharp on the corners they can tear and scratch um, the material of your purse and you don't want that they can also snag on the rhinestones or something so when I am done recording I am cutting these tags off I always keep the stuffing for my purse like the inside stuffing I will not throw this away unless I'm going to use the purse I like to keep the purse's shape and when I do end up using the purse and I throw away the stuffing if I am no longer going to use this purse and then I switch it out I will take like a sweater and stuff the purse just so it doesn't get um, all misky bobbled it doesn't get wrinkled it doesn't get smashed it doesn't lose its shape because these purses are expensive and they are beautiful and you know we want to keep them as nice as possible so yeah like back here I try to keep all my bags I know they're kind of giant girl can you talk <laughs> I know they're kind of like a little bit jacked up because um yeah life happens I just I just ran to go to the store today so I grabbed this purse off of that shelf the other bags fell in the process your girl didn't have time to pick them up who's in a hurry but so yeah I rotate my bags all the time and this is a super cute um Steve Madden purse this is from TJ Maxx so yeah super cute um so yeah I do change out my purses a lot so if you're like me and you love purses and you go through them like crazy 
I suggest stuffing your purses when you're not using them because they can lose their shape and nobody likes a misshaped purse. So yeah. Um, yeah, and then also make sure you take the tags off. You don't have to throw them away. Say you want to make a video and you want to show um, your purse and the tag and how much it costs and the name and all that. Just put your tags in a zipper or inside the purse or something so it doesn't ruin the actual purse. So, yeah. Look at how pretty this is. It's woven and it's so gorgeous. I absolutely love her so much. So yeah, that's just my tips and tricks and advice on looking for bags and how to store them and keep them nice without damaging the material. I think that was everything. So yeah, if you stuck around to the very end of the video, make sure you put a heart emoji down in the comments below. And please, oh my gosh, let your girl know. Have you guys found any of those Juicy Couture suede purses? <gasps> I've been seeing them all over TikTok, and I hope I'm not too late. I feel like I'm too late on finding them. Oh, I wish we could order them online, but we can't. So, and I'm not paying over 150 or up on Macari or Poshmark or anything like that for those purses. If I find them in store then it's a it's amazing it is like my lucky day if i never find them then it's not meant to be so yeah anyways i hope everyone's having a wonderful and blessed day i know it wasn't that long of a haul the video might be long i missed you guys i hope you guys missed me too i'm sorry i'm looking a little crazy your girl had to go out and do a little bit of shopping and yeah, that's like my therapy. I love looking at all the girly stuff. And I wish I would have got a little bit more girly things. But yeah, so I will see you in my next video. Make sure you uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And click that little bell so you never miss a new video from girl. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye.